They would be our muscle cells, the heart being a very important muscle that you want to keep beating. It's a big consumer of triglycerides. The muscles, the big collomicrons, the big VLDLs coming out of the liver, they go into beds that express the triglyceride dissolving enzyme lipoprotein lipase, muscular beds or adipocyte beds. The triglycerides are hydrolyzed to fatty acids. They enter those muscular beds and then they can be oxidized for ATP. In an adipocyte, the fatty acids are pulled in, reconverted to triglycerides and stored for future energy needs. So that's what VLDLs do. But if you have way more triglycerides in your liver because you're insulin resistant and your liver is overproducing them, the liver makes very big VLDL particles. Earlier on, I talked about, hey, there are certainly NMR signatures of insulin resistance. The big VLDL is one. A normal person with physiologic triglyceride never makes big VLDL particles.